Hello everyone, this is my first video on the sport diagnosis series. I will show you a rare case and it will be helpful for your various exams, for quiz, even your day-to-day -day practice. I am showing you the image of the patient, those who came with the main complaint of the not having a single permanent tooth. And these are the images of the both the sibling, male child almost 4 to 5 years age group and the female 13 years age. Both are having the affected skin, hair and the teeth. So in this images you can see that ch uh, male child is having a sparse hair and the female is having the alopecia and also having the loset ear prominent supraorbital ridge and also having the shallow cheek, prominent lower lip and both the siblings are having the same characteristic feature and anodontia, no single permanent teeth. So what are the various characteristic features you had seen? Anodontia, loss of hair growth, alopecia, sparse hair, scanty eyebrow, low set over folding ears and prominent supraorbital ridge, shrunken cheeks, thick lower lip and dryness and decreased sweating. Also having the frequent respiratory and other infections. Also having the frequent episodes of the hyperpyrexia. They are coming to the OPD frequently because of the complaint of the fever. So these characteristic features in which patients are having the affected skin, hair, teeth, nails, we label as a ectodermal dysplasia. This is the hereditary disorder. Almost 7 cases in 10,000 births occur. It is a complex group of disease. It compromises almost more than 170 different clinical conditions in which the developmental defect of the tissue which derived from the ectoderm occur and more than 2 tissues from the ectoderm affected we will label as a ED in which the skin, hair, nails, sweat glands, teeth are affected and there are two major types depends on the number and functionality of the sweat gland. X-link anhydrotic hypohydrotic type is the more common also known as Christ Seaman's Torrens syndrome in which the sweat gland either absent anhydrotic or decrease in the number. Another type is autosomal dominant hydrotic in which sweat gland are normal in number known as Clouston syndrome. So this is in brief about the ectodermal dysplasia. Thank you so much.